Hello dear students now we are going to discuss today the disorders of skeletal system the two main disorders we will discuss number 1 is osteoporosis and arthritis so let's talk about first the osteoporosis what is osteoporosis as we know that bones are made up of calcium so in osteoporosis uh, uh, there is a decrease in the density of the bones and uh, there is a loss of calcium and phosphorus from the bones and the bones become soft and brittle and osteoporosis occurs and it is due to the malnutrition that is the if the person is lacking and not taking the I mean, enough amount of proteins and vitamin c and then the lack of physical activities like running walking and playing outdoor activities and deficiency of the estrogen hormone in all the age there is a decreased secretion of the growth hormones that it leads to decreased deposition of minerals and the bone matrix and the uh, osteoporosis the that is the bone disease it basically occurs in the adults especially in the old people and old and it is more common in the old women arthritis basically the itis word means the inflammation so arthritis arthritis mean inflammation in joints same as that of the osteoporosis very common in old age and in women and uh, it is also characterized by pain and stiffness in the joint and which part of the joint may feel pain and stiffness is the um, hip joint ankle joint that bear the weight of our body the treatment of arthritis includes the painkiller and anti-inflammatory drugs and uh, there are many types of uh, arthritis few of the example we will discuss here osteoarthritis rheumatoid arthritis and gout in osteoarthritis it is due to the degeneration in the cartilage present at the joints or due to the decreased lubricant production at joints and we know that joint is a point where two bones meet and then the uh, they cause the movement so these two bones in this type of arthritis they fuse together and when they fuse they are uh, not able to move totally become immovable that's why the this is the degeneration and the cartilage we know in the joints there is a presence of cartilage between the joints the second one is the rheumatoid arthritis that involves the inflammation of the membranes at joints and the symptoms in the rheumatoid uh, rheumatoid arthritis are the fatigue low grade fever pain and stiffness in the joints the third type that is gout it is basically occurs by the accumulation of uric acid crystals in the movable joints basically the uric acid Uh, the crystals of the uric acid deposited in the movable joints and it cause gout and uh, generally attacks the two joints so here the disorders of the skeletal systems and our chapter support in movement comes to an end thank you allah fees